Well, I'm doing my first home sleep apnea test. Um, it's the PAT technology peripheral arterial tone. It's pretty cool. It's a little uh, wrist watch component called the watch PAT 300. And uh, it measures seven parameters. I got this little finger probe that measures motion. If I'm uh, moving my body and where it's located. And then this sensor also um, measures the peripheral arterial tone. Um, so if a patient has um, an apneic event, they get a sympathetic reaction where their blood pressure goes up and the blood to the finger is cut off. So the sensor picks up that there's less blood flow. Um, and then obviously they'll also picks up the uh, pulse oximetry, which is the oxygen in the blood. Um, and then the this device is a microphone that picks up snoring and also picks up the motion of the chest uh, if it's moving up or down. Um, you also have uh, blood pressure reading. Pretty cool. So this device is supposed to start testing as soon as I turn on the button to test. And it'll test all night, all my uh, different sleep, sleep stages, non-REM sleep in one, in two, and three, and then uh, REM sleep, pretty cool. So based on whatever um, parameters I have, they'll be able to tell if I have mild, moderate, or Obstructive sleep apnea. I'm very sleepy right now. It's a long day of a bunch of stuff to do with sleep. Um, but anyway, I think it's pretty cool. So I guess in the morning, I'll be able to tell, because um, they'll be able to download the information very quickly as soon as I give them the device into the cloud. And that will allow them to derive a bunch of different factors that can determine how I sleep. So I'm pretty sure I'll be fine. Um, but it's kind of cool to do a home sleep study. Um, this thing is supposed to be like five grand. Um, go figure. Um, it's made in Israel. So everything that's cool is made in Israel. So I've had a lot of lasers that are made in Israel as well. Just thinking about that. Um, Seems like Israel's always the uh, forefront of military and medical science. Probably a lot of other things that I don't even know about, but I know the military because I was in the military and medical science because I'm a doctor. So they're always doing something. They're always ahead of the pack. So God does bless them. They are God's chosen people because he gives them the answers to everything, seems like. And this is a pretty good device just to think that instead of doing an in-lab uh, polysomnography, you can do a simple three point test rather than having all the probes on your head, um, uh, nasal probe to check your breathing, pulse oximetry, and then these tight bands that go around your chest that they're called uh, uh, chest wall plasmography that checks the way your chest moves. And that's kind of crazy. And they used to actually put something down your esophagus. That is torture. Just to do a sleep study. I don't know if I could sleep during that. But anyway. Um, yeah. Very cool. It's been a crazy day. Um, but anyway. A lot of memorization coming up. It looks, seems like it's just a bunch of memory work. Got to re figure out how all this stuff works and how it integrates. And, um, yeah, so there's all my stuff there. So I gotta get up at five. So I gotta go to sleep now. But looking forward to seeing what the results are.